morning it's tuesday it's the 30th of november last day of november and today because i won't be here tomorrow we'll start opening the advent calendars you haven't even seen the advent calendars yet because i was out yesterday i never got to show them to you uh, i never got round to showing them to you oh this morning i am in need of recommendations i have finished this which i recommended in a favorites a while ago it's the sgx myc do it all three in one dry texture spray and it's volumizing it's somewhere between a texture spray a dry shampoo and a hairspray and it was absolutely bloody brilliant and typically as these things are i can't get it i can't find it available anywhere which is super annoying or could i find it and it was more than i wanted to pay i've only paid about three quid for it the first time on amazon there's none available on there i think it's been discontinued but i need a texturizing spray because i need something just to give my hair a bit of oomph i'm using dry long story short i went to boots I found a new texturizing spray, not one that I've used before, but one that I thought might do the job. I queued up in boots and the queue was so long and so slow that I put it down and left. And that was about two weeks ago. And I haven't been in a boot since. Um, but yeah, I need to go and get myself a texture spray sometime in the next couple of days. So any recommendations that you have for such an item would be good. I don't particularly get on well with the salt ones. I have tried a couple of the salt ones and they don't really agree with my hair. Um, couldn't get them to do much. Anyway, yeah, so recommendations for that sort of thing, if you have any. Next thing I need to do is, a, I'm on my way out to do my parcels, but I'm gonna quickly do a lateral flow test first, because um, obviously I'm off to Bournemouth today, seeing my dad tomorrow. And um, obviously just want to make sure that I don't have COVID before I go. Um, what else is going on today? I still, I've done all my parcels this morning. I've done my two mile walk. I need to, <laughs> here is the list for today. I need to edit and upload yesterday's video. I need to film a video for Patreon and upload that. I've got to do a little bit of eBay listing. I want to put the Christmas tree up in my bedroom and I need to do some more work on my accounts and I want to leave here by about half past three to drive to Bournemouth because um, I'm getting there for in time for dinner at my mum's. Um, so that's the plan for today. Quite a busy one. Feeling like this whole week up until we get back from being away on saturday night get back on sunday it's going to be quite a hectic week now um i was trying to space it out a little bit better but never mind we like a bit of pre-christmas busyness so that's all good right i'm gonna do this test and um go and drop my parcels off the irony of these being made in china is not lost on me the best laid plans and all you see this is what happens when you do vlogmas you think it'll all be plain sailing it's only going to take me half an hour to get that video up uh, edited and then it will be uploading that's true however you forget about the bits where you have to spend ages dealing with techie stuff like the fact today's video wouldn't export in hd it would only export in 720 probably talking gibberish to most of you but um yeah, she just had to mess about for 40 minutes sorting that out. I think I've got it fixed now. But while that's exporting, I'm now going to go and pop the Christmas tree up in the corner of my bedroom, the little pink one. So I thought that definitely merits a bit of music and a time lapse. <laughs>
doesn't that look festive? I'm very happy with that. And as you can see, I've got my advent calendars out. This one here is the Space NK Beauty Advent Calendar. I'm, I've only just opened it. It came in like a cardboard sleeve like that. And I've just taken that off for the first time. And I really like the sort of fairly minimal packaging of it. Um, obviously, these things are quite big on packaging. There's no getting away from it. But... Um, yeah, there is minimal packaging on this. It hasn't got the doors and it's got the little boxes that all fit in. I like the design. Um, the reason I chose Space NK, having studied many advent calendars, was that the cost to value seemed pretty good. That, that was one of the reasons I chose the Liberty one last year and I didn't feel like it really came up to scratch. Um, I can't remember what this cost. I will need to look it up and tell you. Um, yeah, I'll do that um, in a minute when I go back to the office. But um, yeah, the value of the products was several times more than the cost. So it seemed, it seemed like it was going to be good value. Also, the range of products was quite interesting. There was quite a lot of brands I hadn't tried before, which immediately appealed to me. Now, in addition to that, I have also got the Gin Advent Calendar here um, from the Craft Gin Club and Philip Schofield apparently. Now I haven't opened this one either, it's got these um, little gold stars on the front which you need to break to open the doors or pull off at least. I haven't done a very good job of that first one and that's what this one looks like. Uh, it really is sod's law that on the days that you need things to go smoothly because you have a deadline things don't go smoothly. I've given up with my computer for the moment. I've just restarted it. it. Takes ages to restart. I need a new computer really, need a new desktop, but I need to buy one really, just bite the bullet and buy one. Anyway, it's half past 12 and I've decided to stop for an early lunch and an episode of The Real Housewives Ultimate Girls Trip. Is anybody else watching that on Hey You? It's um like a shortened version with housewives from several different franchises going on holiday to Turks and Caicos. And to be honest, I could just watch it for the lovely summer fashion and the uh, beautiful scenery. It's absolutely glorious. But um, why is my television not going on? But yeah, I'm quite enjoying it because I used to watch both Atlanta and New York and I don't watch those anymore. But um, some of the people I remember from when I did watch them are in this one. So I've been quite enjoying it. I don't know how many episodes it is in total. But um, yeah, so I'm going to sit down and watch an episode of that. And um, hope that by the time that's finished and I've eaten my lunch, the computer is playing ball once again. So I've passed two and I have under an hour before I really need to be on the road. 25 to 3 actually. Safe to say, today has not gone well in terms of things happening as smoothly as they should have done, work-wise. They're feeling a bit frazzled. Right, it's time to pack. Packing is what I need to do next. Um, had lots of sales today, which is lovely, don't get me wrong. Absolutely not complaining about selling things. But I did parcel drop this morning and in normal circumstances I wouldn't do another one till Thursday but I didn't want to come home to an absolute shed load of parcels to send so I decided to do them now. Take them to Bournemouth with me and I can drop them off in a parcel shop when I'm there. Today is a day on which I am grateful for the fact that, that's the wrong cupboard as well grateful for the fact that I pre prepare when I get back from anywhere a hair stuff bag, a skincare bag, ready to just chuck in my case and go because, and I also did makeup as I put my makeup on this morning, did my makeup bag. Ooh. So that's all good. Right, just need to throw some clothes in, pyjamas, trainers for walking. Um, not doing anything posh while I'm there, so jeans and jumpers will be fine. And, yeah, that's what I need to do. 
It's 20 past three. I don't know why I'm showing you that, so if you don't believe me, so if you care. <laughs> it's 20 past three and I am packed. I'm ready to go out of the door. I need to get petrol. Then I will be on my way. Also need to get a can of Diet Coke. Feeling a little dehydrated. Yes, I know. I should probably drink water, shouldn't I? I had to pin my fringe back because it was irritating me. Have got time to do one of the advent calendars though. We'll start with the Space NK one. We have box number one. Now I looked this up. The cost of this to buy was 199. It is sold out, sold out pretty soon after I bought it actually. Um, and the value is supposedly 740 pounds. We will drill down into that a little bit more, more as we go through the days. But today we have, oh, that's a good start. I like this, a Sunday Riley. Um, product it's a nice size i don't think it's a full i haven't got my glasses sorry let me get my glasses hold on good job i went to get my glasses it reminded me that i hadn't put my phone charger in so many damn chargers honestly ipad charger phone charger apple watch charger <sighs> everywhere you go chargers and um, also my kindle and i'm nearly at the end of a very good book so um I would have been annoyed if I'd forgotten that. Anyway, yes, yeah, Sunday Riley CEO Glow, which I think is their vitamin C serum. Yes, vitamin C and turmeric face oil. I've been wanting to try this and I just haven't done because it's expensive. And this size is 15 mils. So it's quite a decent size, I'd say that. Um, then it also had with it, look, another Sunday Riley product, which is the a plus high dose retinoid serum and that size is five mil a little one there so I don't know much about that one so I will look up prices and stuff when I get home and um, we can see how we're going and what we think as to the value as we go through haven't got time to open the other one I don't think before I go um, so I'm gonna get in the car I will see you when I get there I've arrived at Mum's. It is one minute to six and we are having a cheeky gin and tonic. Even though it's a Tuesday. We have got, what's it called? Mold. Mold berry and cranberry gin. Haven't tasted it yet. Let's give it a try. It's a new one from Aldi. Aldi was it? Yeah, you got it at Aldi, yeah. didn't you last week? Oh, that's nice. That tastes very festive. Oh, very festive indeed. Be Time for bed, said Zebedee. Oh, I'm sorry, it's going to be a really yawny segment. Oh, I managed to stay up till the end of I'm a Celebrity, which was rubbish, really. Um, it was okay, watchable, you know. We watched that, it's now 10 o'clock, and I am going to bed. But I just wanted to show you this before I went to bed, which was sent to me by a lovely viewer, Ashley who has her own YouTube channel called Paper and Twine. Some of you may watch her. Um, but she sent me this box. It's made from Amazon, but she sent me a lovely letter as well, which I won't read you because it's got some personal stuff in it. But um, she sent me this box called, it says Mrs. M's Act Advent Activity Album. And she made this herself out of Amazon packaging. Mm -hmm. How amazing is that? And inside is this little album. Again, she made this. It was tied up, but I've untied it. And look at how cl this is just, it's so clever. Uh, anybody who can do anything like this, I'm so impressed by. I'm so not one of life crafters at all. And it's just so clever. And it's for every day of Advent up till the 24th and there's a little gift tag which you take out and it has lovely things to do every day so for example this one is choose your favorite photos to put together a family yearbook and then we have go for a long walk and see what you can see have a long soak in the bath when you get home just so many lovely little 
activities do play a board game or card game with family or friends get the neighbours round it's just such a lovely thoughtful gift and just so beautifully made so I will obviously thank Ashley personally but um, thank you so much to Ashley it's so much work has gone into this it's just such a beautiful thing I'm just I'm really touched by it it's just absolutely lovely and I wanted to show you so that's me signing off for today tomorrow you will see a slightly different video which is um, me and Carla with some plans for next year and then there'll be a double two days in the life the following day so I'm going to do the next two days in one video and that will be on Saturday. Hope everybody's had a good day thank you very much for watching and we'll see you in the next one bye bye